Okay, folks, I just love sharing gems from my personal story as it unfolds on a daily basis because those are the most heart touching to me. Those are the ones that God just ordains to have happen in my personal life. Um, and these are some of the ones I want to share right now. Um, because, yeah, it's one thing to uh, solve the names of everything in world history and then the thesaurus and all the English words and uh, companies and all that sort of stuff and cities and locations and the names of everything. Uh, but it's another thing to find the gems or just experience the gems that God ordains in your personal daily life. And uh, those are the most heart touching because that is, God knows what's best for you. I, I love this children's book. I have this children's book sitting right here. I love that title. God knows what's best for you. God knows what's best for me. Pardon me. Um, but it's just, it's just amazing, okay, to, to get the personal gem. So that's why, you know, God has made me like this incredible detail-oriented person and uh, I have like crazy good eyesight, like better than 20-20 vision. Um, but anyways, so gems from today <laughs> that are just mind-blowing, okay. Um, oh man, there's just too much here. Um, I'm overwhelmed. I really enjoyed my time with Belle today again. Um, always a blast. Um, but Mr. Molino is the principal of the school. He came and said hi to us. It's the first time that he's ever been in the library and came over and said, said hi to us. But it's just a total revelation that Mr. Molino, both divided by three, just stunningly beautiful. And then his first name is Morcello which is so stunningly loaded with threes, like Morcello Moino, Mr. Morcello Moino, like it's just, if you say Mr. Morcello Moino, that makes 243, like it's just, it's so embarrassingly perfect for the number three. And uh, he said hi to us today, just by divine orders. I'm not joking, folks. Um, like one of the most pow pieces of clothing that I love seeing on Belle is her green skirt. I just knew that. <laughs> I just, and lo and behold, she was wearing it today, and I get this word from the Lord. I honestly, I'm seeking God at the end of the day, I'm in prayer, and God just puts the word in my head, green skirt. Green skirt. And of course, I know that's Belle. Like, <laughs> and uh, it's just so pow. Like, it's so beautiful. The G in it together with the T to make 27 the perfect cubic three, the S and the N make 33, and then the chain links and the bookends, like, and then all these center letters, there's three letters exactly that divide by three individually, R, I, R, which are 18, uh, 9, and 18, like, pure nines. It's just insane. Green skirt. Like, it's just perfect. It's just absolutely perfect uh, mathematically. And uh, that's one of the favorite um, dresses that I've seen Belle wear. Just uh, her green skirt. It's just awesome. Um, this was mind-blowing. The very first uh, uh, question that we opened the book to and, and solved was literally this. In three lines, this is what we wrote. 3 to the x equals 27. 3 to the x equals 3 to 3, x equals 3. Like, it's so mind-blowing for the number 3. By the way, a 3 plus an x. x is 24, okay? And, of course, you've got a 3 sitting right there. So, by divine order, it's 3 plus a 24 equals 27. 3 plus, 3 plus 24 equals 27. Like, it's just all of math is designed to glorify the Trinity. The fact that we choose X overwhelmingly as the variable name, X is 24 triple eight. What is this? And what is the section that Bell and I were working on today? Exponential functions. Exponential divides by three. Function divides by three. Exponential function divides by three. Okay? Um, just like the word equation divides by three. So an exponential equation divides by three. And I'm not joking, folks. We wrote down these exact three lines, and Bell spoke out loud, x equals three. Like, and it was just like, just the most obvious three fest of all time. I had another amazing occurrence with Bell while we were tutoring, where um, a couple of her friends ended up coming over, but she was uh, just talking about how much the number six is like every woman's favorite number, and I'd never heard that before. But all I know is that like six is king for the number three, and God's been speaking to me like crazy about how like 
six, six, like, like pure threes, pure threes, right? And uh, <laughs> Bell wrote like three giant like sixes on like the, this page of her workbook and then the next page and she was just making comments about how six um, is a woman's favorite number. It's like how many women, how many should, kids does a woman want? Six. And she like wrote, she's like six is the answer for everything. And I was just like, this is unreal. Like I'm just, I'm just seeing the beauty of God for the number three in real time. Amazing. And of course, Bell's name is perfectly a triple of twelves or six times six perfectly. Like it's perfect for number three and six, right? It's all for the Trinity. The Trinity, the Trinity, the Trinity. God is three persons. And so, but this was the exact three lines, no joke, that we wrote. Like, she opened her book, this is where she was at, and this is what she writes. I'm just like, the threes are just on fire. Um, and then Mr. Moino comes in and says hi. Like, it's just unbelievable. Morcello Moino. Um, and I tell him I'm sitting in the front row of the play. You know, front row divides by three. Play equals love. And I asked him if he has tickets, and he's like, oh, we're going to try and get a night where all five of us can come for his family, right? I love Mr. Moino. He's such a friendly, happy person. And the whole atmosphere of the school, like, he's just... But Marcello Moino, okay? It's just mind-blowing. Uh, I love the gem green skirt. I love that. Never, like, just GT27, SN33, R divided by 3, R. It's just perfect, green skirt. God will, it's just amazing. Um, now this was, this is really awesome. Uh, Belle shared with me today that one of her grandmothers is a florist and her other grandmother makes dresses for her. I was like, okay, what better combination could you ask for? Florist adds to 99 perfectly. And then I got this word from the Lord. What is the word for someone who makes dresses? Well, a seamstress is what they're called. And look at how beautiful the word seamstress is for the number three. Okay? The whole thing divides by three, but now knit the letters together like a seamstress knits things together for the multiples of three. What I, you can do this so many beautiful ways. I was just getting gaga over the word seamstress and it's got so many beautiful S's. S is one of my favorite letters and obviously God's because it's the pluralization of everything. Seamstress. It's just very sensual. Even. Um, but uh, you've got the first, what I did is I put the first and the middle and the last S together on the same team. Three S's, boom, boom, boom. And then I kind of came in, you can, and then the next letter's in, E and S divided by three. The next letter's in, E and A divided by three, okay? And then you've got this central M and T on the other side of this, we make 33, and then the R divides by three all by himself. He's the only letter divides by three. He can join whatever team he wants. He's like the wild card. In the game of cards, he can, he can join whoever for a multiple of three. But that's, and what's really amazing is the word grandmother adds perfectly to one, two, three. I knew this one before. For the glory of the Trinity, by divine ornaments. Um, and then a grandfather adds to 102, which is the first three-digit number that divides by three perfectly. So both of these two three-digit three digit numbers are kings for the number three. Grandmother adds to one, two, three, and I've said Grandfather adds to 1, 102, which is the first three-digit number that divides by 3. The three digits add to 3 perfectly. Both of these are kings for the number 3. They are divine, and when you put the two of them together, grandfather plus grandmother, you get the famous 225, the full precise birth name of this famous person right here. The Queen Mother. And that is why she is the queen. Her full birth name adds perfectly to 225 for the glory of the Trinity. The perfect square of 15, 15 times 15. Elizabeth, Alexandra, Mary. And every name is loaded with 8. Elizabeth is 88, Alexandra is 80, and Mary, of course, is 57, triple eight by the law of prime. That is why she is the queen. 225 on every coin and every bill in Canada, the queen mother. Okay? And what does that say? It says, by the grace of God, DG, by the grace of God, Queen. See that? So it's God's sovereign will for his mathematical pleasure that she is the Queen. By the way, my full birth name adds to exactly three points higher than 225. It's 228. But 
grandfather plus grandmother adds to that famous 225. The exact same value as the queen mother. And by divine ordinance, I found this exact tuning while I was delivering uh, newspapers. The Langley Vance, which divides by three, Carrier divides by three, Newspaper divides by three, and the word Tuni divides by three. It's very beautiful. The word Tuni is one of my, this is a Tuni. And I love the uh, um, Tuni. There's three letters that don't divide by three, three that do. The famous word net is in there, which makes 39, and then two O's and an I together make 39. It was a pair of 39's in the word Tuni. Okay. Now you know why I found it. Um, and the number of strokes divides by three, it's 12. Six letters divides by three, 12 strokes divides by three, grand total is 39 plus 39, the tuning. Okay, and by the way, gold plus silver adds to one, two, three perfectly. So, there's, there's another famous one, two, three for you. Gold plus silver, which is, of course, the idea behind the tuning. Gold plus silver adds to one, two, three. And of course, the queen is 225 her full birth name to the glory of the trinity so grandmother plus grandfather equals 225 which is 15 times 15. god's favorite number to glorify the number three is 15. it's the center letter at of the name jehovah the center letter of god oh 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 here we go okay okay so 15 times 15 through the roof that is 225 grandmother plus grandfather um and so, but Belle shared with me that she, she has one grandmother that is a florist, and she has another grandmother that makes her dresses. I was just like, you've got to be kidding me. Like, this is, like, perfect. I'm just, I just, like, what, what better career for a grandmother than to be a florist and a seamstress? I'm like, perfect. Finally, some creative people in the name of love, you know. Florist adds to 99, every letter divides by three. Three, 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 and then ST are the marriage couple made in heaven that are three strokes perfectly. Um, and then seamstress, my goodness, that was just loaded, and it's just beautiful. So, you know, take the three S's that are like a pitchfork in the whole thing. There's team number one. And then you just, team number two, team number three, team number four, and the R is a wild card. He divides by three all by himself. He can join whatever team he wants. Um, What's another word for seamstress? A clothier. Someone who uh, creates clothing of any sort and deals in clothing. Clothier is so beautiful because it's got the most famous word, the, sitting in it. Those are the only letters that don't divide by three. The, the most famous word in English, adds to 33 and three letters and nine strokes. And then the rest all divide by three, adding to 90 perfectly. You can't ask for more. A clothier. Man, how many, how many millions of people is that? Working in clothing, as we speak. Um, and then a tailor, okay, 75. All these letters divided by three. Wow. Just stunning, you know. Stunning. Tailor, clothier, seamstress, florist. God created all these people, gave them the desires and the dreams and the loves that they have from birth, and ordained them all for his pleasure and glory. You need to do what you want to do, because that is what we call total alignment. When you are saved in Jesus' name, and when you are filled with the Holy Ghost, and you are desiring God and in love with God, you have to do what you want to do. You have to do what you really want to do, because that is what you call total honesty, total alignment, okay, and totally God's best for your life. Um, so, but I truly think everyone should get to experience being a florist and a seamstress for the cause of love. There's such nourishing activities. Um, and uh, this just keeps getting better and better, folks. Um, whenever I uh, go to see Bell, I show up big time early. And that's like a new commitment that I've been hearing from the Lord just in general. Never be late for any appointment. Always show up early to any appointment. My children have lots of time. Okay? Um, you know? And uh, God has given me this word, waiting here for you. There's a song. I've had this worship song going through my head. 
Uh, waiting here for you. We're waiting here for you. Even though we're weird, Vice Pit 3. We're waiting here for you with our hands lifted high in praise. Waiting here for you. It's just such a pleasurable, beautiful, the people of Fiji get this concept. Man, they're, they're so relaxed. I'm waiting here for you. I am going to go early, okay, and I'm going to sit here waiting for you. That divine set of letters. I get goosebumps when I preach on this one. Waiting here for you. Husbands should show up early to appointments with their wives. You know, it show up early and sit there and wait. Waiting here for you. Um, or you can just say waiting for you. Okay. Um, because here divides by three, four divides by three. Uh, so you can say waiting for you or waiting here for you. Um, and then this is a divine gem that I got from the Lord. Arrive early. We're going to talk about that. Of course, when we tutor, when I tutor Bell, we do math. That's 21 plus 21. I mean, it's obvious. Um, and the number of strokes in math is uh, 12. But 21 at center, 21 flanking. It's the easiest foursome for the number three of all time. Um, but we're waiting here for you. Waiting here. Waiting here for you. Wait on the Lord. You spend quiet, silent time on your knees in His presence. And then when I go, you know, to Tudor Bell, for example, or any appointment, it's like, show up early. Uh, arrive early. So let's quickly hit that gem. This is so beautiful, this word from the Lord. Arrive early. The first letter, A, is the most famous plus one, being one itself. And then the Y is equally famous because it's the last plus one over a multiple of three. These are trill letters. Plus one, plus one. Front and back. Arrive early. Okay, because you can say earlier, or you can say earliest, so this Y is like a trill character. It's like the exit from the threes. And then the word Earl just screams out the number three. It's six plus um, 18 plus 12. It's literally the three multiples of six going up from six. Six, 12, 18. Genius. It's just amazing. This is a divine word from the Lord. It's literally a commandment. God is the king of efficiency, and very often he will use... The minimum, almost all, you will use the minimum words possible to communicate what he needs to communicate. Arrive early. That is a two-word command that God will speak to me, say, arrive early. Arrive early. And then you can stick the word always in front, which is three times three times three times three. Always arrive early. But look at the gold train. I already wrote the numbers here on the gold train. I'm going to zoom in because this is really important here. Um, I already wrote the, uh, the uh, numbers here for arrive early. 18, 18, 9, 27. That's pure nines. So you can combine them to make a 36 and a 36, which makes 72. Then this train in here is 36. So you've got 36, 36, 36. Genius. Amazingly, Bell. Man, my face is really big there. Um, <laughs> Uh, the name bell is 36, okay? So 18, 18, and that is the person that I was essentially arriving early for today. So 18 R, 18 R, 9 I, 27 B, E. So 18, 18, 9, 27, that's pure nines. And then in this foursome of Earl, you have, you can get an 18 from 6 plus 12, and then another 18 from the R itself. You've also, in, uh, in this grand total, you've got three R's, which is three 18's. It's just maximum nines, 18's, 36's, like, and then this, all this gold train adds to the famous 108, which equals worship. Arrive early. Like, you can apply that to every, it is, it is sheer gold, because you should apply this to every appointment that you ever have in life. Okay? Far better to have fewer appointments and more knockout relationships. Remember, you only need Adam plus Eve plus your kids. I mean, you, you really only need Adam plus Eve plus God. You only need yourself, God, and a significant, your, your spouse. That's what God said in Genesis chapter 1. That was paradise. So, I'm preaching first and foremost to husbands and wives. Arrive early. I'm preaching foremost to husbands in particular. Arrive early for that lady. 
And always do that as best as you can. Arrive early. Arrive early. That is, I love that. It's just sink. It felt so good. Folks, I was sitting in the library. I showed up at um, Brookswood Secondary School where I tutor Bell. I showed up at 1.30 even though we don't even though we don't start tutoring until two o'clock. I showed up a half an hour early. Okay. By the time I got up into the library, it was maybe only 25 minutes early. And I just sat there in the seat where we like to have the table where we sit at and waited. And it is pure pleasure to arrive early and wait for someone. It is pure peace. It is pure respect. It is pure pleasure. It is pure blessing. God will literally bless your appointment more because of your act of generosity that you showed that person by arriving early. He will simply bless the whole appointment and the whole thing will be baptized in peace, in joy, in laughter, in all the good things. Um, and as I, as I was there, I got to just, you know, I just enjoyed being in the school scene and, and looking at some of the young people around and what they were doing on the computers. And um, It's very healthy for your soul to be given time in new environments. And just slow down. Arrive early. Like, it's just so beautiful. Arrive early. Um, 36, 36, 36, 8, pure 18s, 9, all over the place. The gold train adds to 108, which equals worship, bookended with plus 1, front and back. That's the same. That's God ordained that in the word God, and all. I've done it for a long time. But it, what's really cool is that the A is the first plus 1, and the Y is the last plus 1. It's clinical perfection. This two-word command, arrive early. And then always adds to 81, which is all factor 8 divides by 3. Just like 108 worship is all factor 8 divides by 3. So you can say always arrive early. And then what's cool with that is the A in the front of always becomes the new plus 1 at the front. The rest of the letters in always can join it together with this A, okay, at the front of arrive. And so now the gold train is literally 81 plus 108, which is 189, which is so king for the number 3. It's 3 times 3 times 3 times 7. Always arrive early. And I just got this word for the, from the Holy Ghost. For her. Whoa. Always arrive early for her. Watch this. Watch this. Because the only two letters that don't divide by 3 are a plus 2 and a plus 2. And amazingly, they both di they differ by 3 points exactly. H is 8 and E is 5. Both of those are plus 2 over a multiple of 3. Okay. Um, differing uh, by 3 points exactly. Okay. So, always arrive early for her. I got another word from the Lord when I was going in to see Belle on an earlier occasion that we were tutoring. And the Lord spoke to me saying, never lie to her. Never lie to her. And now I'm seeing always arrive early for her. So let's, let's put the word always in front here so the writing is on the wall. What I, I want to get to the grand total of this. So now, I just always arrive early, okay? So the A in front of always becomes the new plus one lead. And then all these letters knit together now with this box car. The train now links up like this. So these guys knit together to make 81, which divides by 3, joining this box car of 3's and then the Y's, the trill on the end. Um, 36 plus uh, 45, wow. So, 
So I'm curious, so now what you have is the two plus twos. This plus two can knit together with the A at the front. This plus two can knit together with the Y on the back. And now we have three perfection. So this divine phrase, always arrive early for her. This is a word from God. Always arrive early for her. And her name is Bell, which adds to 36 perfectly, which is the crux of this command, arrive early. Um, okay, so always arrive early for her. So always arrive early. Okay, so the gold train of threes was 189. Now we're adding, okay, another nine here. Um, so 198 plus another 30 is 228, my full birth name, plus um, 228. So 234 plus another 33 is uh, 267 plus another 18 points to finish it off is um, 285. Yeah. Always arrive early for her equals 285, which divides by 3 perfectly. Um, it is 3 times 95, which is really cool because 95 um, divides by 19, divides by, it's 5 times 19, which is the 3rd prime times the 8th prime. It glorifies 3 and 8 simultaneously using the law of prime. So that's very cool. Always arrive early uh, for her. So that's two amazing gems. Always arrive early for her and never lie to her. Those are two divine words from the Lord that divide by three perfectly. Always arrive, so arrive early. Always arrive early for her. Waiting here for you. Whew. So profound to show up early and sit there and wait. It's one of the strongest acts of love that there is because time is very precious. So when you go early for someone and you sit there and you wait, that is incredible generosity. Okay, and then the car I was driving is called a Fusion, Ford Fusion. Fusion is one of God's... <laughs> it's what powers the sun, <laughs> okay? Uh, six days of creation, in fact, 33 here, 36 there, 15 there. It's, it's king for number three. That's the name of the car that I drove, the Ford Fusion. The Ford Fusion. I like to say it like I've said it. The Ford Fusion. Um, I just love... All the details that God has ordained in my life. Folks, I've owned these things before I even had the revelations on the numbers. But this is the cologne that I've been putting on lately, including today. B-O-O-S. <laughs> Do the math on that one. The two O's are king, 15 apiece. B-S makes 21. It's pure threes. That's, that's the name of this stuff, and that's what I put on today. And I've been putting it on for the last multiple times and perfumed by by three. And... Shocking. Um, so that's 51. <laughs> it's like the most obvious naming of all time. It's like the letters are even spread out to really emphasize the, you know, add them out. Um, I love solving everything. I, I get ideas and words from the Lord just from everything. It's awesome. It's so abundant. Uh, while, while Belle and I were uh, tutoring together, um, she loves to draw. She drew an elf in her math book. Fantastically good looking elf. Um, green elf adds to 72 perfectly. That's the color elves are. Okay. Um, a green elf, just that divine text, adds to 72 triple of triple eights. Um, I have been led by the Lord, um, including today, to have olive oil baths. And we solved olive oil a million times. It's just so screaming over the number three, every letter, you know. Contains the word love, oh well, just screaming it out, okay? Um, but it's extremely life-giving and nourishing for your skin. Put it all over, I put, put it all over your skin, including your face, a little bit in your hair. That's honestly why my hair is looking a little bit uh, 
you know, shiny. It's a touch of olive oil, no joke. It's very healthy um, all over your skin. And it makes your skin look very healthy and vivacious and you feel terrific. And um, all through the scripture, people were anointed with olive oil. Enough said. Um, okay. This is so cool. Green skirt. Um, and then uh, that, that opening equation that we started with is just out of control. And then, um, of course, um, Bell is a triple of 12s in a number of strokes that divides by 3. Here's 12, number 1, and then each of the L's is 12 all by itself. It's perfect. And then the first letter B has three strokes beautifully, and then the E and L together are four plus two strokes, which is six strokes, six strokes. All together, that's 15 strokes perfectly for the number three in the name Bell. Beautiful. And that's what the name Bell means. Beautiful. Um, I love that. The word joy perfectly parallels arrive early. The J and the Y are plus one. There's O at dead center. It perfectly parallels the word Jesus, perfectly parallels the word God. The word joy. And of course, it's all about love, people. That's where it's always all about, because that's who God is. It's always all about love. Perfect cube of three, perfect cube of three. Always all about love um, in nine strokes, three times three. It's always all about love. Hallelujah. Divides by three. And I can't wait to go see this play next week. It's early modern. Millie, because Millie divides by three. And her last name, Dillmount, divides by three. And it's going to be the most awesome three fest ever. There you go. Awesome gems from today. Uh, so there you go. I'm relating my personal story and um, just the gems that God ordains um, day by day in my personal life. Amen equals 33.